Hello there. Um. Hello there. I'm back at Hogwarts Legacy. The game has downloaded. It downloaded about three days ago, but I've not been home for the last three days. It literally downloaded like an hour after the stream ended last time out. What the hell's going on? Some bugs. Do not step. Streamer mode. What? Both. Um. No, I need to do this. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Um. We had some issues last time out because the game didn't finish. So we need to continue the game. <laughs> and it's just going to show me all this stuff again. Which I need to skip. That's what you're seeing. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Come. Now I have to see this bit again. Hopefully this time it will just play. <laughs> I've seen so many people playing this. I've been jealous. I don't like Harry Potter. I just want to see this like. Game set feels a lot louder than me. Please let me play this time. I hope it does. Yes, we've made it. We're probably like five hours late. Oh, good. We haven't missed the sorting ceremony. I'm no expert, but that seems more appropriate. Now, I need to study. I don't this know. My clothes were kind of cool before. The ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Well then, Daryl. Ready for the sorting ceremony? Bro's done goofed. Night jealous. Black. Prepare yourself to meet the headmaster. Hello. Fig, nice of you to join us. The sorting ceremony is over. There were <laughs> dying complications. complications. It seems the goblin Enough. problem has. Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig, and I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. All right. I haven't come all this way for nothing, you know. Professor Weasley, we've one more to be sorted. Who are these goofers in the back? You're just in time. Have a seat. Thank you. I am quite truly excited to learn what's about to happen to me. Ah, yeah. 
That's a bit older than the others, aren't you? You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. Hello. Welcome. I can't wait to explore. I'm looking forward to exploring Hogwarts and the world beyond the castle and grounds. Hmm. Indeed. Much can be gleaned by having an Same. It's so spirit. goofy. But your professors have a great deal to teach you as well. But yeah, you've come at the right time. I wonder. Mm. I detect something in you. A certain sense of... Mm. What mm. is it? <laughs> mm. Um, ambition. I would say I am ambitious. Is it ambition? I may seem single-minded, but it is important to go after what you want from life. Hmm, interesting. Interesting. You recently learned that you possess a rare ability. I detect a growing sense of ambition, an eagerness for power. Voldemort. Perhaps you belong in Slytherin. Slytherin is... Um... <laughs> is that good? Is that bad? I feel like Slytherin was always the bad one. I mean, hey, the hat shows for me. The hat gets what he wants. But I can choose. Intelligence, creativity, and wit. I'm quite witty. But I'm not creative or intelligent. Gryffindor. Daring, bravery, and chivalry. Hufflepuff. Patience, loyalty, and hard work. Or Slytherin. They are elitists. Do you think I should go for Slytherin? That is what the hat shows for me. Or do I pick something else? I think you'd be Ravenclaw. Okay. Or Slytherin. But I feel like Slytherin were the bad guys, and Daryl Goodwin is not a bad man. Daryl, actually yes, Daryl is intelligent. He's witty. He's creative. But is he hungry for power? I don't know. I don't think Daryl is. He did quit his job for a much more high-paying one, so maybe he is. But... I like to think of Daryl as a creative man. And you've a ready mind. Quick to learn. Yes, that's me. That's Daryl, all right. Ravenclaw is where I'm going. The sort who you makes the nature. Ravenclaw! Yeah. Yes, that, that is... That's the... <laughs> This is the whole shtick that I'm going with. Oh, and one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. What? Enough! It's not as though I've banned flying altogether, but... Don't tempt me. Wait, does this mean you are that they just did not know how to make Quidditch, futures. so they just cancelled it? I'm sure you will have plenty to do I want to do Quidditch. Tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Were well, we meant to cheer at that? Quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. I'm Professor Weasley. Would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Please. Well, is this like Ron Weasley's great grandmother well, or something? As deputy headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. I hope we get something cool. Oh. Text just it's quite uncommon taking a bit of time to load. Might be a bit of a challenge, 
but one I'm sure you're up for. I am, Professor. This is the entrance to the Ravenclaw common room. You must solve a riddle to enter. I he much help, was I'm it afraid. Mr. Goodwin this who did dingbats? I mean, they're not riddles, but... Who lived longer? The ghost? Or the poltergeist? A ghost or a poltergeist? Hmm. A non-being can never have been. Well done. I'm so Go glad that I didn't have to do it. that. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. <laughs> Which one? <laughs> I was in like the main hall or like one of the actual other common rooms of the houses. I hope I have a cool common room. Ooh, it's like I'm in Princess Elsa's hat like room. Everyone's gone. Better head to the common room. The dormitory. <laughs> the dormitory. Oh, I forgot that that happens. Appleby Arrows. Yeah, what year is it? I would like to know. Let's save. Is it 1612? Find your common room. Oh, I'm just... Do I share it with someone? Oh, share it with three people. But they're not here, so that's great. Do I go upstairs? Yes, I do. Run. Run, Daryl. <laughs> this should be interesting. Wow. Everett Clopton. How are you, Everett One Clopton? Moment. Watch this. Is that a bomb? <laughs> Oh my god, I thought you just threw like a grenade. That wasn't quite the reaction I wanted. Oh well. Right. What did you hope would happen? I suppose I hoped it would lighten the mood. Ravenclaws can be a bit on edge the first day of class. I'm Everett, by the way. You seem downright calm next to some of these characters. This feels like a, a, a top set maths here. class. I'm glad to be here. Ready for classes to start. Good. Glad to hear it. Truly, there's no reason to be nervous. Most professors are firm, but fair. I mean, not all of the tricks I play are as simple as a tossed dung bomb, and I'm still here. Wait, did you say most professors are firm, but fair? <laughs> oh, this will get but a giggle. Probably best I let you judge for yourself. Get a, getting a giggle out of Ravenclaw. I should wander off before someone traces that dung bong back to me. Well, it's not rocket science, is it? It was literally around the corner and you're just standing there. Introduce yourself to Amit and Samantha. Look at our room. We've got like a penthouse. What? Hello. What's this? Can I light it? No. What's up? Eat wizard. Must be different. Starting Hogwarts in your fifth year. Got stuck with fox ears. Improvement, I thought. Not right either. Hello, Samantha. Samantha Dale. I want him to be in the perfect place, a place he'll be happy with, but I can't seem to find it. Great golden gobstones! I want him to thrive here. I can't golden believe she's just said that. <laughs> My own little expression. I bought this Dittany seedling from home and I so want him to feel cozy. Dittany is amazing, isn't it? So much healing power in such a little plant. 
<laughs> I've a bit of a thing for plants, as you can see. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. I'm Samantha. Nice to meet you, Samantha. Is Disney used in Wigan World Potion? It is. Looks like someone's because been she studying has a up plant. on their potion making. Actually, Professor Fig told me about the Wigan World Potion. Of course. I heard you were studying with him before term. He's an enigma fig. Bruh. Teaches about theory. It seems to know a lot about practical magic. It's quite knowledgeable. Professor Fig does know a great deal about um, different forms of magic. Well, I hope he told you about more than Wigan Weld. You've lots to catch up on, I'm sure. Shut it, Samantha. Isn't... Oh, yes, isn't it Hufflepuff who likes plants? You're right, you little nerd. An affinity for herbology is more typical of a Hufflepuff than a Ravenclaw, isn't it? Ordinarily, perhaps. But it runs in my family. We've a full plot of these little fellows back home. I suppose you could say herbology is in my roots. Or you could say you're in the wrong class. Do most students grow their own ingredients? Is it common practice for students to grow their own ingredients? Oh, yes. In fact, our herbology teacher, Professor Garlic, encourages it. Garlic. And I don't think Professor Shuffle oh, Potions Master God, cares that's, where you get your ingredients. As that's long a as brilliant name, perfect. Professor Garlic. It was nice to meet you, Samantha. Good luck with your ditany. Thank you. And good luck to you too on your first day. Okay. Oh, I've just ate an apple. That's just brilliant, hello. Amit. Brilliant. You think you could buy hello? Would you like to take a look? Uh, yes. What are you staring at? Can't see too much in the day. Well, except for stars like Sirius, Canopus, Vega, and Arcturus. I'm Amit. Pleasure to have you in Ravenclaw. Go on, Never Chess. Who's been so what close house is before. astrology linked in? It, frankly. It's nice to meet you, Amit. Since you're a know-it-all. Oh, yes. So much to be learned from the stars. Also, there's something about the open air and night sky above the tower. It's invigorating. You will adore astronomy. Professor Shaw is incredibly knowledgeable. I hope astronomy is on my schedule. Sounds interesting. I have good news for you. You are most definitely <laughs> taking astronomy. It is required for all fifth years. You will be enthralled with the tower. Plus, a quality telescope can show you things you never dreamed of. Gr is Gryffindor the one them. that yes. Harry Potter oh, and, and all that were in? Us, better get to my first one of the year. Nothing like the smell of fresh parchment, is there? Be seeing you. Hey there. New Ravenclaw. Professor Weasley is looking for you just outside. You would best not keep her waiting. Who's saying that? <laughs> Can I like, kill people? Asparagus. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts. They're all meant to be different houses. But I feel like they would have been better if they were. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the Headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Wow. Here you are. She really just did that. What is it? It is a wizard's it's a field book. guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? 
seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. Oh, this way. goody. The guide will give you Lumos. opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding law. We're going downstairs I the Ravenclaw would have Tower. Something like the field guide when I was a student. Yeah, but you're old. I'm young. I'm Daryl Goodwin. I deserve Why don't a field cast Revelio on this bus. Lumos. And see what details Wait, the field guide. How do I do How do I Revelio? Revelio. This bus created in honor of Ravenclaw House resides in the lofty Ravenclaw Tower. Ooh. Oh, I like this. Oh, there's so much. Clever, isn't it? <laughs> Keep your eyes open for opportunities like that inside and outside of the castle. Do we really have to what? Oh my god, look how long this bloody staircase is. Can we not just... No oh. time to waste. You've classes to attend. Well, you're going really slowly, aren't you? Um, I have no idea. It's a lot of numbers and things. Well, where's this girl going and where's he going? Is that Amit? Ah, I don't like timing. him. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use blue flames to get around a bit quicker. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. Oh, that's cool. Can I, like... In this view, you can see the flu flames available in that region. Green flu flames represent flames you discovered. Fine. Dang, we got teleportation. Quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. The paintings actually move in the you can game. Get anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. Wow, look at this. Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Our King's Cross station, so to speak. This is cool. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day. And you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. I'm afraid there isn't. I'm sorry, Professor, but I'm afraid that's all there is to it. 
Hmm. Almost precisely what Professor Fig said. Speak of the devil, Professor Fig. Your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. The... Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfect what happened there? Carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit chat. I need to get to class myself. So much of being in a rush for class if I'm just stuck in these stupid conversations. Of course. Thank you. Good luck today. Thank and you. remember to use your field. A glitch. Got to report it. Valuable to you, and invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come yes, and find Professor. me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. Um... Start your first. Uh, everything feels a bit compact. Like it feels a little difficult to navigate, but it should be okay. Hello, Fig. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you masterfully evade Professor Weasley's interrogation regarding our late arrival? I did my best. But I'm fairly certain she suspects that we're not being entirely forthcoming. Well, yes, not exactly. Well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your Let's time just kill than everyone. she approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you There's to be well trained. There's a lot of well just trained. dialogue. Happily, There's not a lot you have of, the benefit of an exceptionally playing. skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not so subtle reproof from Professor Weasley. Yeah, genocide. The clever enchantment we included in the field guides. That's why I love games like Fallout and Skyrim. Because you can just kill everyone. Alright, new quest available. On the map. Oh. The map is enchanted to help Which you Which one did I pick? Way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead. Yeah, there's like the odd choice you can make. Supplies, including your Hopefully the game one. picks up speed. you enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. A lot of things have just happened. Um, right, uh, close that. Let's 
Let's get on our way. So Charms class is upstairs. Run! This way. Oh. oh my god, it's so far. Look at this. Nope. They do be flying. Okay, game proof. You cannot jump off the bridge and jump on your wand. Defense against the art, dark arts. Oh, here it is. This fig. My God, what is going on? What the? What? They be ghosting. Hello, Ravenclaw. It's me. Here. What I? Behind you. There is an open seat here. Hello. Hello, I am Nettie. So you are the new student. Is she in Gryffindor? Have you Professor Ronan yet? <clears throat> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to Year 5 of Charms. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work. But I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right? Now, everyone, please open your textbooks to page 517. But before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change and growth charms? Hoggy Watties. Yes. Mm -hmm. Um. Uh, 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 I am afraid it is too late to study now. Mm. I haven't studied at all. By I just came here for the first time. Really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> uh, mm. Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Hmm. Well, it seems that we are in dire need of review. This is Everyone for get into this is for real. Like every lesson of, the of school, when you'd come back now, after summer holidays. And so I'm like, oh, does anyone know what two plus two is? No one knows. One another's hands. Only right, one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. I shall look now, no worries, no worries. You're in an eSports game. Woof. Win. That's what we say. Run, run. I now know Accio. We are trying. Accio. Oh, it is actually how you say it. That is not bad. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Well, as you all seem to have the basics down, and it is an exceptionally lovely day. But it was just me who did it. That we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me. Ooh, outdoor class. Ah. Dang. I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree. Hmm? <laughs> so, what better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? <laughs> oh god, is that that GTA minigame? <laughs> 
So why don't we have our newest students start us off? Hmm? Eh? 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 Okay. Very simply, cast Accio on one of the spheres and relinquish your charm at the last possible moment. Accio. Now, uh, think oh. of this like splendid. Well, I don't, I don't think I did that right. That's it. Oh, do I have to hold it? Excellent. Good oh. Job. Not to worry. Shut up. Shut up. Very good. Points to Ravenclaw. But there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up. It's on like Donkey Kong. You'll be the blues just as before. <laughs> Not Sai and Daryl. <laughs> yes, sir. So do I go first? No, they go first. I think it's a. What if I'm going to be like a, a massive asshole, right? Come on, Daryl. I just knock him out of the way. Oh. Very good. Let us see this. Oh, well that. All right then. Move. Oh, bollocks. Well done. Be sharp. Right, I'm gonna bring this one over here because I can definitely knock one of hers off. Come on, Daryl. Oh, fuck. Is that both in 50? Oh, we tied. How? Oh, they are two and fifty as well. Let's make this a bit more interesting, shall we? What did he do? Oh, well, that's. <laughs> I think we are well past interesting at this point. Well, this is a bit unfair. I'll say. Enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. All right, this clip right through me. What if I lose? Okay, Daryl, you know what to do. That is how it's done. Akio. Akio! Oh, e no! <laughs> I'm just gonna do this to her each time. This is unfair though because yes. you don't get away from Daryl that easily. Yes, fall off. Excellent control. There. You're joking. Oh, oh, I thought they'd hit theirs off. There we go. I know what I must do. Honestly, Akio. just get this one off. Booyakasha! Oh. Have that! Very good, both of you. Well done. Thank you. Is that it? <laughs> Are we done? Class is dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. I don't have anything. Good game back there. I must admit, I think I understand. Yeah, that was dirty. Me. That was like proper. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. I'm glad you understand. That's good to hear. It's a lot to take in all at once. To put it lightly, I remember how I felt when I first arrived. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. 
Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. Is Wagadu a castle like Hogwarts? Its address is Mountains of the Moon. It is not it's so on the moon. a castle as a beautiful edifice carved out of the mountainside. I remember the first oh. time I saw it, the mist was so thick I could hardly make out anything at all. And then it just materialized before me. Gotta go grab something. It's for heaters tonight. That seemed to be floating in midair. Um. Is Wagadu much bigger than Hogwarts? <laughs> Wagadu School of Magic is the largest wizarding school in the world. Really? So yes, bigger than Hogwarts. But it never seemed intimidating or overwhelming to me. It always felt like home. This may seem an odd question, but is magic the same there as it is here? Mm, mostly, yes. Wagadu. But I did have to learn how to use a wand. Wagadu. Hardly do, anyone do, at Wagadu do. uses one. I don't know the rest of the song. That's incredible. You can cast spells without a wand. Oh, yes. I how do you think Dr. Strange does it? To be much more instinctive. Not to mention quite convenient if one is without their wand. I must admit, however, that I am growing quite fond of using a wand. It seems very dramatic. Thank you for it's telling nice me. to learn about another wizarding school. Thank you for asking. I do miss Wagadu, but I am glad to be here. Ah, I think oh. Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. Oh, if I press triangle, it skips dialogue. Time. Thank you. Bono, Bono.
Hello, Hogwarts. I'm back. Eat my fajitas. Oh, bollocks, bollocks, but This headset is so creaky. This is um this is based. I think we should all here today look up to Daryl Goodwin. The sacrifices he's made for wizards all around the world. If you're so inclined. Well, a you're word using if you clothing, would. Clothing, to be precise. You though. wanted to speak you with me, Professor. I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation. Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? You did well, managing to best as gifted a student as Miss Onai. Thank you, Professor. I enjoyed the match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Homework. Expect Come to hear on. from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. First class student. Nice going, Potter. So, where now? So there are side quests available, which are these black ones? No. I have to go to defense against the dark arts. That is what we're doing next. Run. Hello. How was your first day coming along? <sighs> what do you want, Samantha? Hello, Samantha. Nice to see you again. I wondered how your first day was going. You certainly seem to hold your own in charms. <laughs> okay. 
Thank you, but it really wasn't all that challenging. My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Then again, he tends to be a bit overconfident in his. Well, better see to my charms homework. I find Professor Ronan's lessons a bit more challenging than you do. Uh, all right, Samantha. There's a treasure chest up here. Is there? Uh, Revelio. Oh, yeah, there's something down there. Nice and then the werewolves join friend. the goblins goblins in the uprising. Werewolves, where were you? In the Goblin Rebellion of 1752. And by the end of it, the Minister for Magic was Albert Boot. No, it wasn't. <gasps> oh, what fun! I won't say my goodbyes. I shall cheer for the boy who says you're telling me. Peeves. <laughs> you can do better than that. What? Whoa! It's enough. How far I just jumped. I'm gonna jump down all the stairs. Oh! Get out of my way, everyone! Move! Oh, wait, what? Oh, it's upstairs. Stupid. Hello. Stupid. 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 Is that all you've got? Let me also! Professor Hackett! Perhaps you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces in your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. Knowledge. Knowledge, strength, and integrity. To the wise, age matters very little. Today we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso? A levitation charm? Levioso! A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? Eat One that, thing I've it. learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Now, let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. Set your wand. The Vioso. Levioso. Now, let's try something a little larger. Begin with a basic cast. See how the dummy deflected your cast? Yes. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Remember, a surprise. Good. Now, well done. Do that. Very good. But the best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelist, take your marks. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, <laughs> I want a fair duel using only Levioso, basic cast, and Protego. You may begin. I could use Protego. I don't remember. This should be easy. 
You're good. Now perceptive. Oh, I don't know how to use How's it. The view? Not good at this, aren't you? How do you use potato? <laughs> I don't remember. My sister got me roses. Oh, sweet. Is it triangle? Why do I not? You're not gonna make this easy, are you? I would eat that, Sebastian. I know. I don't know how to use levy. Just triangle. Protego. Protego. Levioso. This can't be your first. Let's just say I'm a quick learner. Who oh, no. knew? What, what are you going to do, Sebastian? Not bad for a beginner. You give as good as you get. I put you on the spot, and you rose to the challenge. Points to Ravenclaw. Thank you, Thank you Professor you. Hackett. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, I don't want to talk well to Sebastian. Again. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. All right. That's enough spectacle for one day. Class is dismissed. If you know the right spells, it's dark wizards that'll be... I'd hate to face Professor Hecate in a duel. Do I have to talk to him? Revelio. Revelio. Huh. Always thought Levioso was for fun. Nice work. I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? It felt more like I was dueling an expert. Sebastian Sallow, by the way. Didn't I can't tell if this guy is nice or an so asshole. Deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first duel. In fact, it was. Perhaps I have a knack for it. Be coy if you like, but I know better. Magic requires intention and talent. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. Exclusive and unsanctioned? Count me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. Oh, if you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's joining oh, oh, yeah. a secret dueling club, or sneaking into the restricted section of the library. You just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Thank you, Sebastian. Invisio. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Invisible. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. If you're interested. Why are all these people's names time. like this? Cheerio. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Oh yeah, hang on, if I... Revelio. Revelio. Doesn't do anything. Uh, uh. 
So, where do I go now? Talk to Luke and Brattleby. Place is massive, man. Hello, we're on the bridge having a swig. Potato. Oh, don't do that. That's not necessary. Whee! Really? Oh, not again. Here I come from the toilet. <laughs> Bowl, where she said I could swim, did you fancy a mole? As long as we're only one time per week, I can plunge. I'm not having it. Not for the mean. Was it air? I was at the bathroom. Stop me, did rancorous carp sought to trap me, confine me inside of a jar? But he failed us, did his contain? He's so loud. I want to go outside the grounds because this place is massive. Where is Hogwarts like set? I know it's in like the UK, but where? Revelio. Well, what does that do? Levioso. Oh. Yeah, Scotland would make sense. Hello. Oh, it's um Sebastian. Can I help this, you? This this is li he's like a five year old. Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. I coordinated duels for crossed ones. A dueling club of sorts. It's invitation only, so you must have really impressed Sebastian. I'm flattered to hear that. Sebastian's not a bad duelist either. Imagine it's quite something to see the two of you duel. How does cross wands work exactly? You show up. Don't cross the streams. Duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end wins. It's our way of determining the school's greatest duelist once again. Kids just running squid game. And to liven things up, the winner is awarded a prize. What's the prize? I'll join it. Of course. Dueling's an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, in Cross Ones, you can duel with a partner if you like. Your first time I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along or duel alone. So, care to step into the ring? Get me in the ring. Let's get it. Let the fireworks of course begin. he says that. Spectacular. Let's get let's get this show on the road. We'll make you regret signing up. Oh my god. We'll make you regret signing up. Eat it, Lawrence. Oh. I'm not like. Act like a winner. Eat my wand. Mind the wand, Levius. Lumos. Accio. Levius. Easy. Pity more people can't watch the duels. Nice work. Sebastian wasn't wrong about you. There's strong competition ahead, but keep this up and you could be the next school champion. Brilliant. Count me in. I shall. Now, it takes time to organize these duels, but check with me later. I may have something lined up for you. Again, congratulations on your first Crossed Ones victory. Well fought. Thank you. Hope to see you back here again. 
level one lock. Can I go out through here? I'm level three. Where do I need to go now? Here, what is there? Weasley after class. Press Weasley wants to see me in their classroom, which is off Transfiguration Con Courtyard. Can I just teleport there? No. I can teleport here though. So, oh, no, just travel there. It'll do me good. Go this way. Potato! Ooh, my side. Wow. Look at me, I'm Daryl Goodwin. <gasps> Cat! Oh. Levioso! Levioso. <laughs> Cat! Akio. This is our class. What about the room, Professor? I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. Oh, uh, excuse, Deke. <laughs> Goodbye. Ah, there you are. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit before you arrived. I'd oh, wager yes. there's a good deal more to your travels here than what oh, you Oh, shot me. it. Isn't there? There's not. Nothing more, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a streeler. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Oh my god. What? I'm not sure I have time for extra assignments, Professor. You shall find the time. You'd be astonished. I'm just never going to do them. Like paying off a student loan. loan. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier. We've arranged to replace I'm the finish the stream from around your way 10, here, just including to watch seeds, some stuff. potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Thank you, Ollivander Professor. will connect you with the perfect wand. Mr. Oliver. You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. Oh yeah, Mr. Krabs. Um I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Oh my god, does it have to be Perhaps Sebastian? Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. They're the only two people I've spoken to. Um, let's go with Natsai. Natsai. Or Natty. I'd like to go with Natty. Excellent choice. Miss Onai is one of our most talented students. And she knows the air. Something a bit quirky keep about you well Sebastian. clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavoury local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. <laughs> Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. Butterbeer? You don't, you don't get me on. Weasley after class. I think I could go to Hogwarts in real life. Ah! Ah, there you are. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed I do, and an exceedingly useful one at that. The mending charm, Repero. Fixes things right up. 
makes a broken object this guy's outfit's in the cool of an eye. Hmm. it seems as if that might come in handy more frequently than one would imagine as professor weasley mentioned i am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers a number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. See them through and then report back to me. We will have you casting Rapero in no time. What is the purpose of these tasks? Why must I first complete tasks to learn Rapero? No lesson or lecture can compare to first-hand experience, and these tasks should provide you with just that. Such experience is invaluable when mastering any new bit of magic. Fine. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. Whatever. Levioso. Levioso. It's like the this flying the page right near the broken statue. I wonder where the flying page is. How do I get it? Oh. Um, Akio. Got it. Collect the flying page in the defense against the dark arts tower. A flying page must be around here somewhere. Akio. No time for chit chat. Only time for Ronan. Akio. I trust the preliminary task. I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Thank Let you. us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Remember. Your wand is a conduit of your magic. Oh, got it. They changed it. Go. Repero. That's it. Very good. If you would now? like to practice mending something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it. Why could no one else do this? Did he just out. purposely break it? Do you think they could have one called Cleano, so they could clean everything? It looks a little dirty. This is a nice area. Where do I go now? How much for the game am I through? Let's save the game. Oh, I have new face wear. I have gold rim spectacles. I have black leather gloves. No, I don't like them. Um, oh. That's all the same. I'm 1% through the game. What? I've explored nothing. Protego. Welcome to Hogsmeade. I'm not that far, I guess. Yeah. Hoopla. I do just be jumping there. Oh. Akio. Akio. 
I have to say every spell move that I do. Am I in the Great Hall? Hello, Hello. Natsai. Looking for me? Um, no. Natty, I hope I haven't kept you waiting long. Not at all. Professor Weasley tells me that you need to go to Hogsbeat. She, <laughs> you must be she could have been here for ages. Again. And to see the village. I've been looking forward to it. Good. Shall we set off? I intend to give you a first-rate Hogsmeade experience. I'm excited. Ooh. I feel like I haven't been given a tour of the school when I should have. I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to accompany you. Well, really? it was actually my suggestion. Yes, I had planned to extend an invitation to you myself. I thought you might enjoy a butterbee in the village. <laughs> the timing of Professor Weasley's owl was perfect. Out we go. I cannot tell you how nice it is to breathe fresh air after being cooped up in ancient rooms. Grave mistake wow. to take it as an elective class, believe me. Oh, um I believe you. Though I suppose you would not really I was too mesmerized when your mother was the one who elected that you take it. Revelio, wait. Revel Revelio. Revelio. Oh. Hogsmeade is beautiful this time of year. Everyone will tell you to visit at Christmas, but that's one of the few times of year I would rather be indoors. I hope there's a Christmas action. <laughs> Not much so for the cool. gold, are you? Oh, Bro, you have a broomstick and you're so walking with it. It has taken some getting used to. I did not grow up around snow. Oh, wait, over here. Hello? I often spot lacewing flies in this area. Oh? What's so special about them? They are interesting to look at. But if you stew them, you can also use them in potion making. Jesus. Let's keep going to Hogsmeade. Where is it? It's quite far. Shouldn't you be in school? Look, from the Forbidden Forest. Hippogriffs. I wonder if something startled them. I heard rumours that hippogriffs... Well, probably the gunshots. Jesus. Do you think Poppy's already seen the hippogriffs? Absolutely. Likely already named them. Soup and Sugarfoot. Had to take a screenshot of that. That's the Forbidden Forest on the left. It's off limits to students, as the name implies. Well, let's go Why in. Is it off limits? The professors claim it is too dangerous. I think that calling it forbidden only makes it more oh. alluring. Ah, there's Hogsmeade over the crest, past that ruin. I'm guessing the Forbidden Forest is where all the spiders are and stuff. I don't have time for them right now. Who's this? Half of Puff! Oh wait, no. Gryffindor? I think she's in Gryffindor actually. I would spend all of my time exploring if I could. I confess I was surprised when Professor Weasley mentioned that you knew the area, since you're relatively new here. She said that? Hmm. She knows more about me than I had thought. I will say, while I certainly learn a great deal in class, much can be gleaned outside of the castle walls. How are you settling in? I remember the weeks that followed my arrival feeling quite strange. Everything was so new and unfamiliar. I'm getting used to things. This is so far away. I still miss my homeland. 
But it is beautiful here too. So how and much stamina do we have? We've just been running for ages. Quite a bit. Hogwarts has become something of oh, a home is. now, I would say. Hopefully it will for you too. Mr. Moon! He is the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure. Um, you might want to turn back, Miss On I. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. What did Mr. Moon? Jimmy, guys, ugly and airy and mm, terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. Oh, come on, that sigh. Poor Mr. Moon, a demigod. I think he had too much fun in the village. I will say that I have never seen him in such a state. Rebellion. Nearly there. There is Accio. much to see outside of the castle. Levio. Not just hugs me. Accio. I am happy to explore whenever Ooh. you'd like. Rumors being what they are about goblins and such, it might be nice to have a friend with you. I'll keep that in it mind. No! Well, we need to watch you in a minute. Here we are at Hogsmeade Village. I love that this world is... that this game is open world. Like, there's just no loading screens. Cat! And here we are. It is hard to know where to start. The Three Broomsticks is the place for butter beer. And you can get any sweet you can imagine at Honey Dukes. I could not choose a favorite oh, shop here. It changes with shop, every visit. Okay. I can right, tell you that you are certain to find everything you need in Hogsmeade. You can just go in. Can I go in anywhere? Oh my god, I can. There's something in there. Sorry, Natsai, I've kind of just left you there. Oh, um, Akio. Eat that. Ooh, a chest. Wasn't it? Rebellion. Hello, I'm back. Aren't you bothered that people think of you as all? I find it wonderful. My mother always said. Fine, let's keep going. Professor Weasley said that you need to get potion recipes, spellcraft, some seeds, and a new wand. Of course! You will enjoy Mr. Ollivander, and I am keen to see what you will do with a wand of your own. You should be able to collect everything you need I'm and very still excited. have time to explore a little as well. Experience Hogsmeade at your own pace. We can meet up in the town circle when you are finished. Enjoy yourself! I will see you soon! Fine! Ooh, has his own map. I can get a haircut? What's that? The old fool. <laughs> Where does Hagrid live? Well, he probably doesn't exist at this point. <laughs> okay, I'm going to leave it there for now. Um... I'm going to continue this someday. Uh, it's going well. I'm enjoying it.
yes. Um, thank you for watching, if you have been. I really appreciate it. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Okay. <laughs> thank you, Daryl, for that. I want to see if my stuff's still there. Yeah. Yes, I will see you all next time. Thank you very much.